Previously on Subpixel Aerospace. I'm a pregnant baby. I'm more excited than... Oh, I almost said something horrible. You got Snapchat. No. You got Twitter DMs. You got Facebook DMs. You got USPS. Okay. And I was like, Ian's not that fat. So basically so. you took away all the work we did to make the stream easy. Yes, that's correct. Together we can do anything. But all our right, problems are gone. Will says bless you. <laughs> That's going in the recap. Oh, this is so cool. Oh, this is so cool. Please tell me you can just roll us like it. a tumbleweed. Are we and still on uh, the wrong oh, gravity? No. Was that a lie? We're just really successful. Oh my gosh! Look Jeez. at it! It's, like a, it's still spin. over there. It's still going. Yeah, that's weird. I'm surprised it's not like Otter putting them in there. Well, I think we may have something here. Holy crap! Holy. What does control locked mean? I made one of you a pilot. <clears throat> no, we're both scientists. Maybe scientists. Yeah, we're both scientists. You think I'm kidding, but I think we may be able to make it to Duna right now. Damn. What? Damn it. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to play this stupid game anymore. <laughs> make it to Duna, you son of a bitch. Hello everyone and welcome to yet another Subpixel live stream with Subpixel Aerospace playing Kerbal Space Program. Co-pilot today is Will Crosby. Are you out there? That's me. I'm out here. Fantastic. Are you excited for another, f I'm not going to say failed journey to Duna. I think we're going to make it today. How are you feeling? I am I am ready to relax on the lovely things mm -hmm. on mm -hmm. Duna. I was going to say beaches, but I'm mm -hmm. not quite sure. Well, what you knew this like? stream was coming for a week, and we've been talking on voice chat for 15 minutes now, and that's the best you could come up with. Airline food is <laughs> very Seinfeld's bad. still a funny show. Been streaming it a lot lately. Anyways, it let's kick it over fun. to the game. Will, I'm being serious. Uh, we've got to make it to Duna today. It's got to happen. It's got to happen? Yes. Or um, you want it to happen. We're not going to sleep until it happens. <clears throat> Do you make... Sh okay, did we put a uh, butt for on our uh, ship? What's a butt for? Uh, for pooping, you idiot. <laughs> <laughs> That's not fake laughter. That was pretty good. Boom. <laughs> <laughs> Do a not bust. A bunch. Hey, everybody. That's true. If, Zach and Mom if, are uh, here. Oh, God. Zach. Hi. Uh, if Ian doesn't make it, he has to uh, create a bust of himself out of mac and cheese. In in Kerbal or in real life? In real life. I don't like this. I did not agree to this at um, all. That's why I, I'm on my way down there this weekend uh, to make sure it happens. Um, okay, before anything else happens, first I have to show something to you. Ian, um, I, I told you numerous times I do not want to see that. <laughs> That's pretty good. Um, <laughs> so Sexual I, assault in the workplace, folks. <laughs> <laughs> so Look, we're I, both engineers. We're not even pilots. I you know. I'm going to fix it. I'm going to fix it. I did some prep work for this. I'm pretty sure I have both a landing craft and the um, a launch craft ready to go. But there is one failed prototype that I need to show you first. <sighs> okay. Are uh, you before ready for we this? do anything, Ian? No. Yes. Don't go. Yes. Okay. Are you wearing a tim horton's hat no it's it's a haas f1 hat see haas oh. f1 team probably can't also see you one. look so look professional right now is it because of the new light that i got i do really like it i don't often watch the stream while it's happening yeah. if folks don't know he just streams his screen of uh Kerbal. discord to me mm -hmm. so i never see it um this is exactly how scanlines is done as well um it's weird when i still see pictures of ian 
I'm like, oh, that's the guy I work with. Yeah. Oh, uh, because he's so, you know. Oh but, man, um, Zach, I wish yeah. I wish Haas was the sponsor. They they are rich enough to have a Formula One team, which cost at least a hundred million dollars a year. <laughs> Is Ian's hat the sponsor? <laughs> <laughs> the sponsor? I didn't even catch that. The sponsor? No, no, no. I'm sorry. They are the sponsor. They are the <laughs> But any alcoholic beverage that I'm drinking is the sponsor. I'm drinking a Golden Monkey Victory. Ooh, I um, Very I was going to drink a cider, but then I got some good advice today, which is don't drink anything carbonated right before you stream or record, because then you'll just be burping a lot. Yeah, but burp, people love, it's it's our ASMR stream, yeah. man. Oh, just like Zoe Kravitz. Okay. Um, well, I need to direct your attention here. This is a failed prototype. This is going to be the solar array for the top of the lander. Are you ready? Oh no. Okay, go for it. Okay. First thing I have to do is That is the greatest noise I've ever heard. Okay. What is the servo control? No, wait. Okay, wait. Nope. Nope. Okay, wait. I think my action group got messed up. I can't wait for us to play Factorio up. so I can look smart again. <laughs> <laughs> my Factorio setups are real dumb, so I'm excited. My Factorio for... setups are like, I guess I restart the game when I mess up like a, a, a funnel. Oh really? Or like a, a conveyor belt. So like, I want everything to look perfect and like have a nice main bus. Okay, I think. Subpixel sponsors include Mom, Zach, and Alexander. Oh, if only, if only my actual mom watched these. Actually, it's probably good she doesn't. God, sometimes I, I, I say bad thing. I don't think. I mean, my mom does. She's in the chat right now. Well, I'm sorry, Mike. I, I wish my adopted mother watched this. Okay, you ready? Go for it. It didn't make a cool noise this time, though. What in the world? Because oh my gosh. Been... Oh no. Is this a droidica? Oh my Oh no, goodness. wait. Okay, no, wait. I did that the wrong order. Nope. Sorry, you didn't see that? Didn't see that? Gonna redo it? Uh-oh, Alexander's here now. Hi. Hi. Okay, here we go. Okay, Can you wait. not kiss at my brothers? Okay, here we go. So... Okay, now it's making a cool noise. Okay, and then here okay. we go with this. <clears throat> How is this not getting any charge? Ian, you're very bad at this. So it's a ball of doom, Mom said. <sighs> Zach said was was broke? Was broke. Zach, are you broke? Do you need money? I need money. I don't. Oh, I, I can just... Buy a... <sighs> Screw it. I'm just going to turn on the cheap. Things are expensive in life. I know. I know. I just want you to appreciate my beautiful thing that I built, but it keeps, it's, it weighs like 10 tons, I think. It's ridiculously heavy. It's completely hey. inefficient. I just want to show you what it does, but it keeps running out of energy, even though it's literally made of solar panels. So let me just, infinite electricity, uh, done. Okay, uh, here we go. Zach, no, I have hush. to send you the password for uh, HBO, by the way. Here we go. Oh, is this going to work? Yes, it's going to work. No, stop. Oh. Sorry, I went too far. That's what okay. she said. Okay. Whoa! What is happening? Well, it's not done yet. Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> it's so good. I like that it just moving at all instantly destroys the terrain underneath it. What is happening? Is that a mod, the terrain thing? Uh, No, it just does that when it takes damage. This is incredible! I know, right? This is like freaking... I don't know. This is like... Uh, it's running so Str well. Strawn Beasts on steroids. I know. Um, horribly inefficient, though. So... I really wanted to put that at the top of the craft, but it slows down my machine when you add other parts to it. It also weighs 43,000 kilograms. <laughs> Wow. It's preposterous. It's preposterous. You wanted to put that at the top of what? The um, the subpixel Duna lander. Oh, if I could okay. just get here. Yep. Here. I just is. wanted you to say that word again. The premise? No. 
I don't know. It's okay. The joke's gone now. Okay, so here it is. This is my baby. It's pretty good, right? Hello, my baby. Hello, my baby. Hello. Oh, let me turn off. Uh, okay, before I forget, turning off infinite electricity, I'm also going to do some Kerbals. Can you kill a Kerbal? Oh, look at that. Freaking uh, mom just said that before you did it. There's a delay, so. You're about yes. to be right, mom. Yes, you're always right, mom. I want to, uh, okay. Let me kill some Kerbals real quick, because I can just kill them, right? Let me kill some Kerbals quick. Who's the pilot? Uh, me, of course. Okay. All right, you're, you're dead. You're the engineer, I'm the pilot. You're dead to me. Why? I had to kill you. Oh. Okay, female, definitely. Name, Will. Um, Wait, experience, level five, courage to the max. Stupidity to the max. Also a badass, also a pilot. Name Zero already in use. Uh, no, let's just make it, uh, just call me William. No! There we go. IE, please. IE. No, why? I hate you so much. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. I'm going to add an extra L in there because it always looks like there's three L's. So let's just make it three L's. Oh, I hate you. No, just make it a capital I. <laughs> Marmon. Hermon. Okay. Oh, uh, I. This resolution that you're spitting to me oh, is not good. I think we may need us to splurge on some Discord. So, uh, whatever. Each whatever. other? What? Uh, on mm -hmm. some Discord? What? I need to splurge on some Discord. Uh, okay. Uh, okay, uh, should we do a test flight of this? Uh, yeah, let's go. Okay. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Yes, yes, yes. Pan, a uh, little bit more to the left. Yes. Uh, well, oh, God, that looks good. That's a screenshot. Wait, wait. Ching, ching. Ah, picture for later. I love it. Done. Oh, um, I love it. Yeah, you know what, Zach? I really like that idea that we have each slancer has their own Kerbal. Maybe in a future Subpixel Aerospace episode, we have to cram like 20 Kerbals and take them somewhere. And that each of them is named after the members of Subpixel and a slancer. That's a good premise. Ian, you ready for this? Yeah. Wait, let me make sure it's all the way up. Ready? Mm-hmm. What's that? That's a song my girlfriend wrote on my pocket synthesizer. Damn, that's actually really good. Yeah, that's pretty dope. Okay. I bought, uh, I took all of my ability to not buy a $1,000 uh, synthesizer last weekend, so I bought a $50 pocket synthesizer. Oh my God. Wait, like and an actual is... pocket or like a, a mobile app synthesizer? No, an actual pocket synthesizer. And it is the coolest thing I've ever bought in my entire life. It's the coolest thing I've ever bought in my entire life. Um, I'll bring it this weekend. Look, we made it to Duna. Woohoo! We did it! We did it, silly boys. Wait, why are we here? This um, is test a test. It. Yeah, I'm testing it out. Should we test it? I know it works. Let's just do it. What am I doing? Let's just do it. Let's do it. Okay, now uh, let me yes, show Zach, you. A quote-unquote pocket synthesizer. It's, uh, the brand is uh, Fleeshlit? Fleesh what? Fleeshlit? I'm Flesh sorry, what? Fleshlight? Is that a Okay, here we go. Brand? SSS Red Dawn. <laughs> Red Dawn? Yes. Oh, no. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> There's a little... Oh, you and your male fantasies. <laughs> That's pretty funny. Okay, let me just check these. These look good. These the ultimate good. penis. A rocket. And there's that. To pop it. There's that. Uh, Alexander, please don't take the Lord's name in vain. It's only <sighs> he uh, capitalizes the G. Also, he didn't uh -oh, say my name. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> that was good. That was real I thought, good. I thought you'd like that one. Okay, so let me make oh. sure we have crew in here. It's Ian and Willie. Oh God, I'm gonna get another beer, Ian, before you launch. Um, Will, come back. We're on Duna. I'm just rolling over to my fridge. 
I think I need to add that as an action. Wait, did you say rolling over to your fridge? Yeah, I can roll over. I'm on wood. Oh, that's actually pretty cool. Yeah, pretty great. Oh, Karen, damn it, I forgot. Hi, Karen. It's not here. Wow, mom, watch your mouth. I don't, I hope you don't kiss me with that mouth. Will, did you hear my good joke? I'm gonna repeat it once Will gets back on. Will. Will, buddy. What's up, I'm back. Um, mom said he is trying to penetrate Duna and I said, whoa, do you kiss me with that mouth? Oh, oh, Karen's here. Oh, well, that's Hi, good, Karen. I almost brought up a sensitive subject. I'm glad. I didn't. What, what was it? Nothing. I mean, you already brought it up. No, I didn't. Okay, all right. So I think. Hey, why is the wrong flag down there? How do you change that? Ian. Ian? Yeah. Why is the wrong flag? Down? I hear you. Where do Ian. You where do you change that? Uh, I think it's at the command module. I don't have a command module. Karen, I'm sorry. Just Cause 4 looks like garbage on the PS4. Oh, yeah. You should probably play it on the PC. Actually, I, I just wait like a year and a half, two years for all the, all the expansions and all the fixes to come out. And then it hits a Steam sale and then I bought it. That's what I did with Just Cause 3. It's fantastic. How Just Cause I... 3 stopped um, sending audio out on my PC, and I've never been able to fix it. Did we ever do it? No, we were thinking about doing a Just Cause 3 video where we played multiplayer. I don't, yeah. I don't know how to set the flag if I don't have a... That's a... Oh, wait, no, it's up at the top next to the red dawn. Oh, I can't wait to clip that. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> It's so smart. It's so beautiful. I don't even know if I can get the whole thing in the camera. Karen, are you uh, smearing Square Enix's name in the dirt right now? There we go. That's pretty Square good. Square Enix, who sold Hitman. Whoop. Sorry, folks. Bump my microphone there. Okay. Karen and I are going to be playing some Apex Legends. I know, right? I'm excited for that. Okay. I am actually kind of excited. I rarely get excited for competitive multiplayer games. So. Did you play um, Anthem? Uh, yeah, it was. I played 15 minutes of it, and it seemed real not fun. Really? I think I'm okay with it. I actually, okay, so I started doing, uh, oh, I still don't. This beer is disgusting. Yep, sounds about right. I, I still don't fully understand it, but, like, sometimes when you're shooting and other people are shooting, they're, like, freezing people, and you start hitting them, or when they're stunned and it like it literally says combo on the screen and there's like crazy like damage modifiers happening and i love yeah. that i love that because i don't know i that's the thing in destiny that made that was just barely implemented and poorly done was the whole like three different types of weapon where it's like what is it like a yellow purple red whatever and then some enemies void. need it some void. some of them don't and it just barely void. makes any sense and it's not clear at all I know you're a Destiny fan, but just shh, just take the criticism. Okay. I love Destiny. Uh, it's funny. I haven't played Destiny since before Christmas. I oh, usually really? take a January break from a lot of games. I don't, Actually, know, I'm trying to figure out what I should play next. You know, Mom, I'm pretty sure... Well, that's the first time I've been in here. I'm pretty sure said. that... Um, Apex Legends is based on the Source engine, so it very well could come to Switch someday. Okay. Um, I'm trying to figure out what to play next. I think I might play um, Legend of Grimrock 2. Aren't you playing RE2? Yeah, but I'm done with the main campaign, so like now I'm playing that on the side. It's not like my focus. Yeah. Okay. Uh, um, 1 30, 3 o'clock, 5 o'clock? Uh, yes, Duna one thirty, Kerbin three o'clock, ship five o'clock. Sorry, folks, I'm just lining up for this intercept. Oh, um, I so I think I might that. play Legend of Grimrock. I might. I don't want to rush Factorio because I want to save that for when we play it together. 
Yes. Um, I did buy Frostpunk because I had a 50% off coupon. Okay. So maybe I'll dive into that. That looks about right. What do you think? Uh, which one's Duna? That's that's Duna. That's 5 o'clock? No, it's one thirty. Yep. I think a little bit more. About one thirty. And we're at 5 o'clock in the Earth set. 3 o'clock. Yeah, I think we're good. Let me bump it up just a little bit. Yeah, we should do Galacticraft, Zach, I know. Okay, folks. It's Ubisoft. launch time. Um, oh, Karen, I'm drinking your hack and sack lager. I don't like it. Okay. Not very good. I can't wait in like 15 to 30 years when our millions of fans are going back to watch our videos and it's just me talking to my girlfriend during a stream <laughs> <laughs> like remember that time uh grand lord will was like talking to his who will, is now um, the grand queen of the universe no it's too late to save that um i'm just gonna humiliate you real Bro? quick because you did that in front of my fiance last week um are you insinuating that you and karen will no longer be speaking in the future Wait, no, I didn't. Oh, that's what I that. thought. That's what I thought. That's what oh, I thought. not on stream. I won't be talking to her not anymore. On stream. Okay, let's see. Because uh, I, I paid for it, Karen. That's why I'm drinking it. <laughs> Can't believe you have a mini fridge in your room. Is there Mountain Dew and Doritos in there? No, there are some Doritos. Why would the Doritos be in the fridge, <laughs> you idiot? Know. What do you think cold Doritos taste like? Oh, <laughs> oh boy. Um. Okay, folks, are I, you ready? Um, I think it's yeah, party time. Yeah, there's a lot time. of Let's go. Oh, boy. Do I have my Kerbals in here? Oh, yeah, they're right up there. Okay, let's just, let's get this. Done. Oh, that is extremely loud in my ears. Um, let me turn it down <laughs> for you. <laughs> oh, we finally launched and you paused it to turn uh, it down for me. I uh, know, it's just gonna, it's just gonna be <laughs> continuous for a while. Oh, it's so good. And okay. separate. Separate. Oh, no, 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 no. Don't flip it. Don't pull a will. I got it. I got it, baby. Separate. Uh oh. You're good. You're good. Uh, I hate women, Ian 2019. Yep, that sounds about right. And then separate. Okay, doing pretty good. I'm at 45. My Apple Apples is climbing. I think I ditched and this last one. Separate. And then I think I'm going to go up to 85. Or I'll do it right there. Oh, I like how. Do you see that arrow is just off our heads? What? Like the, the thermal forces? Oh. <laughs> we're just on our heads. Okay, here we go. So add maneuver here. Whoa. Okay. 10280. Um, the spear's pretty good actually. I'd like to retract my previous statement. Nope, too late. Okay, I think that's good. Eighty. 87, 82, 85, that's good enough. Okay, put it on the maneuver. Oh, I never added RCS. Oh, to you this. idiot. I know. Wait, didn't I? Oh, I did. Hey, it's a little bit. What is it burning, though? Because it's trying to stabilize you? No, I mean, what is it burning? Oh, uh, micro propellant. Monopropellant, micropropellant. But I think it's burning from up here, which I don't want it to. So I'm keeping it uh, off. Uh, check the fuel tanks up there. Oh, shoot. Uh, I think those things are their own fuel tanks. 
These guys? No, no, no. Up at the top. Check. Just check the fuel tanks to see if it's dealing monopropellant. I can't. I can't get in there. Yes. That's at a hundred. No, it's still at a hundred. Oh shoot! I gotta burn. Ian! How dare you distract me? I mean, the good news is once I'm on the thrust, it it self-corrects. This may be a little sloppy though. Ugh. Okay, feeling pretty good. Oh boy. Oh yeah, oh, I got boy. plenty of delta. So I'll have three thousand around three thousand delta V to get to Duna and burn into the orbit. And then I know the <sighs> lander once I'm in orbit. Yep. <laughs> Sorry, I'm taking this so seriously because I don't want to play this game anymore. <laughs> Not forever. I just I want to. Stream. Should we talk about what we're gonna stream next week? Assuming we're successful. Uh yeah, go for it. Apex Legends. We already talked about it. We're gonna stream it. Um, we're allowed to play it before then, right? I think that makes sense. No, I th we were streaming. Or aren't we streaming that Thursday? Oh, are we? That was my intention. Well, what are we streaming next Tuesday? Factorio. Factorio. Yeah, I guess we should. Well, I figured we would. Well, there's not going to be any scan lines this Thursday. Yes. So I figured we'd stream at least Apex Thursday night. Okay. What is it? Five o'clock? Uh, yes, it's uh, uh, one thirty three five. <laughs> okay. So let me add a maneuver there. <clears throat> Pardon me. Set this as uh, target. And then next Tuesday we will. Are we starting Factorio next Tuesday? Well, That's probably a good idea, right? We're not going to play it beforehand. Yeah, we got to get the server set up, though. Yeah. Well, I think we can just... It's not necessarily a server. Oh, we just can connect to each other with a saved game, I think. Unless well, we're going to... Oh, I guess we'll be playing offline, too. Yeah, I, I think we have to. Otherwise, that stream is going to be months long. Yeah. I mean, I'm really okay with that. I really love Factorio. Okay, That's all, all right. I did Christmas 2017 at my brother's house in Utah. So I need some help here. So I need to get that down. So what am I doing? I'm also adjusting this. Ah, uh, yeah. Oof. Well, you gotta get it. I would drag the uh, maneuver around until you get an intercept. Yeah, but the problem is it's hard for me to drag the maneuver around the orbit from this distance because it's like two pixels is the entire orbit, you know? But you can't grab it right here. I know, but look, it's really oh, easy see. for me to to wonk it up. Oh. Oh. That's very close. Do you think that's good enough for now? Once Man, I'm out here, I haven't I'll seen the intercept course yet. Oh, you don't see it there. That's just your closest approach. I know, but what I'm saying is that once I get around here, I'll I'll, I'll do another do corrective again? burn. Yeah. Yeah, because okay. I think I have... I'll have uh, 2,100 fuel left at that point. You know, Ian, do what you want. Wow. Oh, I didn't even deploy my solar panels yet. Oh, look at them. Nice and Aww, pretty. Oh, they're adorable. Okay, my SAS is working. So let's warp to next node. Man, Ian, we got four people watching right now. Damn. What was that live stream? We had like 15 people watching. I think you're making things up. That's never happened since that one time. I don't think it's ever happened, buddy. It was. We had like 15 people one time. I don't believe you. I don't believe you. Are you thinking about our total number of views for the YouTube channel? No. Oh. <laughs> that was mean. <laughs> okay. What's our most watched video? Um Short Well we run it. We we run ads. I'm not ashamed to say that. So it's probably the Pokemon one from Jake. That was real popular though. I think that was like two or that three was. thousand. Jake did a good job. Yeah. It's real um I'm gonna I'm gonna say this, but it's not meant to be mean. But you That's know like what? Ian, Perfectly. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Ian, you, you do yourself discredit. Why? 
Uh, introducing tabletop RGB is our most watched video. How? How many does that have? Uh, 2.2 thousand. 20, Maybe it's because I ran... 2200. No, I only ran ads once on that. Last week Ian, guess two. what the second most viewed video is? Is it Die Hard 2? Get Bin Laden. <laughs> <laughs> it's like run ads, but also have something people want to click. Oh, shoot. Uh, I, oh, the shoot. Bin Laden one's so good. I almost missed my burn again. How dare you, Will? Sorry. Third is Lego Racers, Jake video. Yeah. Fourth is pokemon jake video i say keep fifth. going until we hit a non-ad video so just keep yeah keep saying them fifth is kyle that's an ad technology video. sixth super caesar's palace that's an ad video seventh die hard that's an ad video eighth sub pixel what is sub pixel that's an ad video ninth what is sc introducing scan lines that's an ad video tenth waveform Mm, that's an ad video. 11th Honey Heist? That, that is an ad video. I don't think it was very popular. What are the views on that? 132. I think that is an ad video that I canceled. So what's the next Did I one? say 10th? 11th is Waveform with uh, Oscar Stahlberg and Richard Meredith. That is not an ad video. So that is our most watched video. 114 views. That's not bad. That's 114? We made it. Oh, sorry. Die Hard Trilogy Part 2 was the was the one I mentioned earlier. Yes, that was an that, ad video? That's an ad video. What about Part 1? Part 1 is not an ad video. Interesting. That's at 59. That's pretty good. Our so it must least... be people doing Part 2. I did Part 2 because it has the recap at the beginning, which is a good intro. And uh, then Least watched video. Can you guess it? It's one of the Subpixel Rewinds. Obviously. Yeah. Is it Animal Crossing? Uh, no, actually, where is Animal Crossing? What is it? Animal Crossing is our most watched rewind. Really? Actually, other than PAX East. Really? Uh, it is, uh, it is Shadow of War. <laughs> oh, God, what a terrible game. Um, man, Subpixel Rewind, great idea. I spent forever on that graphic, but it was only a limited number of videos. I still like it though. I do too, especially bleeping out <laughs> stuff. Man, these beers are sitting pretty with me. Will, that's disgusting. You have a girlfriend. <laughs> Karen said plug subpixel on RTF. Uh, I don't know what RTF Karen is, but I don't cross promote. That's um, rich text format. It's an original Word uh, document. True. Although my coworker runs a podcast uh called locked on nets uh which is about the brooklyn nets which oh. is basketball uh I'm i keep sorry, telling him sport? to have me on as a guest and i'll just fake my way knowing <laughs> nothing about basketball <laughs> oh, um, boy. but it's 25 dollars per thousand people for us for an advertisement and i was going to give him like 50 bucks because he has like 2,000 viewers and just write ad copy for subpixel that's Do you bad. think I would get anybody from a uh, wait? How much basketball? Twenty five dollars per thousand. How many thousands does he have? He has around two thousand normally. Oh, so downloads. it's only fifty bucks. Right. It depends. What do, we, a... what, what, what do we think the crossover is in terms of I'm gaming to... folks? I don't know, but I want to write a really funny advertisement that he has to read. Yeah, it's kind of like Easy Allies does that on their podcast. You pay like. I think it's like 400 bucks a month and they read your ad copy, whatever it is, as long as it's appropriate in the middle of the podcast, which is four times a week. And they have pretty good podcast numbers. I'm thinking of doing it. 50 bucks, 50 bones. That's not bad. It's not bad. I'll do it. Okay. I need you to shut your mouth because you're going to make me miss this burn. I'm sorry. Shut it. I just tried to zoom in on your map. <laughs> Did it work? Wait, shut it. I got my burn. You can talk now. I guess I can listen to you. Um, I'm still working on <laughs> fixing my uh, my 3D printer. Um, I haven't had time. What's wrong with it? Uh, I just I'm setting it back to status quo. 
because my coworker did a bunch of like alternative stuff to it. Hey, like, what, he what upgraded. Is it, what is it to get your uh, your camera over here? You know what I mean? Do you know what that is? Uh, you can set, or you'd have to go to it. I'd have to. What, I can't what, just what move mean? the camera over here to redo this maneuver. No, because you're. It's always focused on something. Okay, so if I just burned retrograde here. Man, I'm really feeling these uh, burrs. What does my periaps periapsis need to be? Remember the time we recorded a uh, oh, Jesus uh, scan lines when you had been drinking? Yeah, that was a good one. Wasn't this it? is my revenge, Ian. Can you look up real quick what my periapsis should be? God, I hate you so much. Yeah, that's right. That's why. For what? For Duna. Periapsis for Duna. As in, like, what I want to aim it for. That looks worse. Synchronous orbit of Duna is an altitude of 28, of two 800 kilometer. 2,800 kilometers? You mean your periaps once you're in orbit of Duna? Well, I, I don't know what I'm talking about. I just kind of want to yeah. aim directly for it, right? No, probably not. No, you want to aim to where it's going to be. No, that's not what I mean. I'm trying to... See, I have the, I have the encounter, but now I've got to get an orbit on it. You know what I mean? Yeah. Why is this so complicated? Why you gotta make things so complicated? Okay, all right. Were you just singing Britney Spears? Is that who sings Complicated? No, uh, Avril Lavigne? Uh, chat, who sings Britney Spears? I mean, who sings <laughs> <It's> Complicated? <laughs> who sings Britney Spears? Oh, see, that looks good right there. Do you kind of see my dilemma, though? Like, oh, no. Karen just said yes. Zach said Avril. Yeah, that sounds right. Why'd you have to go and make things so constipated? That's the Weird Al version. It's a bad joke. <sighs> Oops. My, uh, I have two, um, theater. Okay. Um, you know, outside like theaters, um, or I should say outside the actual theater inside the movie theater, they have the um, rectangular things telling you what movie's showing in that room. Yes. So the I posters. have one. Yeah, but not the like sixteen by nine posters, but the yeah, the like square one or the rectangular ones. Yeah, I have. Uh, the re-releases of Empire Strikes Back and Return of the Jedi. I have the two or both of those, and oh. my my Return of the Jedi one has fallen, and it scared the crap out of me the other day. So it's like Fall Fall of the Jedi. Is that a Star Wars movie? Fall of the Jedi. It is not. Um, Zachary, my brother, who is no longer a moderator, mm -hmm. has sent me a picture of him watching. Ian uh, performing mm -hmm. this feat on his giant projector. Oh, um, yeah. In the foreground <laughs> is his cat, Cedar, uh, Cedar, also known as Tiny. And I believe that is his wife's head, unless he's an adulterer, um, on his lap. And then there's Blue, his dog. Uh, <laughs> okay, wait a minute. You cannot say wife's head in his lap and blue in the same sentence I'm sorry uh no her her, her face is facing oh the God. the screen there's no sort of this is um, strictly pg-13 anything happening um i don't know where atticus is the third cat or the second cat there is no third cat there will be eventually because my brother's insane uh, i'm just kidding i love you not really. Well, I do love you. You know what? It's a lot. Zach, there's a lot of pressure right now. I'm sorry. 22. I do love Cedar, three. though. She's very cute. Ooh. Also, okay. uh. Yeah. I'm getting closer. 
I am being nice, Karen. I love Damn my brother. It. Zach, tell your family I said hi. And by your family, I mean your wife. And your cats, I guess, but they don't understand the concept concept of hello. Shelby said she's at work right now. Is that a joke? Wait. No, you wouldn't be working at 7.40 at night. <laughs> this is strictly PG-13, says the guy with, that made the phallic rocket. <laughs> that phallic rocket got us to Duna. Maybe. I can't get this orbital intercept correct. Why is this so hard? I'm glad that joke made Zach get uh, Shelby to come on the stream and write that, therefore giving us <laughs> another <laughs> viewer. Yes. Yes. <laughs> this is how we do it. We just insult people until they join our stream. <laughs> 840? Aren't you three hours behind? Oh, you're two hours behind. California's three hours behind. Bum bum. Is, it was uh, 60 degrees in New York City today. I know, right? I think it hit 70. It's in, February in, in 5th, and it was 60 degrees. I was sweating outside. Because I'm fat, not because it was hot. 60 degrees. Oh, man, I feel like, am I going too fast? Is that why I'm shooting past this? I have not looked at the uh, screen in a while, oh. and it's still the same. You're just I know. I'm just trying anything. to get this to work. I'm trying to sustain the stream by having half-drunk conversations. I don't, I don't know what's going on there. Um, hey, Zach, you said you read that lock-in book that I'm reading now. I, I don't know. Does it get better? I'm really not into it right now. It's by John Scalzi, who wrote Old Man's War. Oh, I really like that man. book. His um, he's just uh, I'm not crazy about him as a writer. I don't know. I like his old man's war books, but it just it feels this like it's I'm not that into. It feels like pop sci-fi where it's just like, well, I'm just gonna describe crazy sci-fi things, you know? Well, so yeah, he's not as pops. Yes, Zach Lockin. He's not as pop sci-fi as stupid Ernest Klein. Um. Which I, again, I like Ready Player One as a book. Yeah. Because it was a great concept uh, when he was like, oh, this kid has to rely on pulp, pop culture to, like, solve this stuff. It's cool. And then he uh, wrote a second book that didn't need that, and he wait, still Wait, when did we start it. talking about... Uh, I thought we awful. were talking about Scalzi, not, not Ready Player One. I'm barely paying no, attention. I, I'm saying Scalzi isn't as pop... Uh, like uh, yes, hundred percent in Greek. Like Ready Player catering. One was yes. trash. It was real bad. No, so Ready, uh, the Ready Player One book made sense why it had all those references because it, it was did. part of it was society. Still really badly written though. I don't know. I was okay with it because it made sense in the context of the book. But then, the his second book Armada. The mm -hmm. character had the same mentality, but it was set it in like our world. Yes. So he just came off as a dick nerd who knew all this stuff rather than like someone who had to know this stuff to live. Yeah. And it was okay. Just okay, not Will, I need you, I need your help here. So what am okay. I doing? Am I I'm getting closer, I burn retrograde, and then once I'm in orbit, I burn retrograde again? Yeah, so once so you okay, need let me, to let get... me show you what I have right now. I have an encounter. You have an encounter. It's 23,000, so 23 So just get closer. Million so meters. So put like a maneuver closer to there. That's when you want to burn retrograde. Like here? Yeah. So I'll just warp here? Or no, I, no, wait, no. let me add a maneuver. Just add a maneuver and let's see what happens. So See, I burn retrograde, but then Actually, my periaps. Actually, burn pro for a second. Oh, you oh, think you I'm know not what? going fast enough. You I'm not in go, orbit yet. You want to go into that encounter first. Before you do this. Okay, so so you want me to you warp into here? That, you want to encounter it and then do it. Okay, so I, I'm going to warp here. Yeah. This is easy enough to reset when we screw it up. Just quick save. Really? 
How do you quick save? I was joking. You can save the game if you like. Hey, look, it says quick save. Okay. Um, Let me try and get in here. Sorry. I'll pay attention now and stop talking about reading. No, no, no. You can keep talking. I'm just, I got real lost. Yeah. Uh, I just okay. finished the book, The Gone World, which um, mm -hmm. I forget who recommended it to me, but I, I got it for Christmas. And then I noticed on Matthew Rory from Giant Bomb had it on his uh, top 10 games of the year. He put a little book list on it. Um, okay. So now you've encountered it. So that's the Duna Escape. So you want to now burn retrograde to Along try here. to get captured? Yeah, captured into Duna. Oh, okay. Yeah, okay. See now. I'm so now it. you're on that Duna encounter. There you go. That's good enough, right? Apo pair. No, I think I want to. Where is Duna? It's gonna. Sh it's gonna show up. But... Oh, it's gonna. Oh, I see. I see. So four million. So I think I want to do. Whoops. What do I want my what do I want it at? Yeah. I mean I guess um, I Zach, I think it's because I went from like burn all a very this, high right? science fiction, like not for young adults book to a young adults book. Is why I'm less into lock in right now. Oops. Didn't mean to do that. <laughs> Come on. Okay, there we go. So now I want to... So that gets me in an orbit. 831,000 meters. That's a good start, right? And then I'll just get to this apoapsis and I'll burn. Yeah, that's perfect. I'm yeah, that's good. It. Okay. Uh, so let me get to the maneuver. Yeah. Yeah. I'm not in an orbit, so that should just give me the maneuver. I'm just trying to get to this maneuver because it takes so long. Um, I've been reading the Culture series. Have you have you heard of that? Uh, is that by Ian? Ian M. Banks, but he spells yes. it incorrectly. I believe it's I-A-I-N, which is definitely wrong. Um, yes, Ian M. Banks. It's, it's pretty good. It has some really interesting stuff. Some of the stories are miss, but... Mm -hmm. um, there's one of the books that is just entirely about a board game and it's it's one of the best sci-fis i've ever read so it's like the the prose itself is really really good some yeah. of the stories are a little wonky the setting is pretty good though um i think i'm on like book five or six and i think there's like eight or something maybe i'll get into that uh, my plan after lock-in was to read ancillary justice What's Which that? I heard was very good. It's uh, I can't think of her name who wrote it. Is um, it Ursula K. Le Guin? No, it's uh, oh, it's someone else. I'm gonna look it up because I'm gonna forget. Uh, I heard it's very good. She wrote Ancillary. Let me see, Ancillary Justice. Uh, Anne Leckie, L E C K I E. Uh, I don't know who that is. So she wrote Ancillary Justice, Ancillary Sword. You mean Ancillary? Ancillary. Ancillary. Well, why was I saying it so wrong? I have no idea. I don't know. Ancillary. Uh, Ancillary Justice, Ancillary Sword. I think I was just looking at it wrong. Ancillary Mercy is the other one. Um, I was thinking of rereading the uh, King Killer Chronicles. Uh, is that Patrick Rothfuss? Yeah, uh, burn a little bit more. You're not quite there. Oh, shit. Whoop. There you go. <laughs> that looks so good. <laughs> oh, no. What is happening? I think oh, I... are you orbited on the moon? No. Oh. Oh, I see now. I think I'm going to oh, hit yeah. it. I think you are, too. But I think that's fine, right? Because what Words am I going to do? hard after two beers. One was 9.5. This one's 5.5. Oh, it's because I have no periapsis because I'm going through it. So I think yeah. I think here I just, what, burn retrograde? Yes. Pretty much. No. Uh, yes, yes, yes. But that's in 25 days. So let me just go ahead and get closer. I'm going to warp. Oh, let me quick save. Good idea. 
and then I'm going to warp here. Sorry, Chad, I'm not really paying attention to you guys because this is horribly it's complicated. Okay. Alexander said words are hard. Yep. Um, and I'm I'm very tired. Oops, I'm excited for bed wrong, tonight. Wrong side of the orbit. Let me warp there. Tomorrow is Wednesday, correct? Yes, it is. Which means tomorrow's my Thursday. Because I don't work on Fridays. Yeah, I took off Friday, too. What are you doing on Friday? Uh, Friday, I am driving to pick up Jake and Kyle, and then Ooh. we are headed down to your house. Mm-hmm. I, I, I got an email today that was like, hey, the maintenance guy's going to be there Friday afternoon to install stuff. And I was like, okay, going to be a crowded condo. Because <laughs> that's like <laughs> right around the time you guys show up. I'm like, whatever. Perfect. Oh, oh okay. Hello, maintenance man. We're just Actually, playing Mario Party. I, I could just save my retrograde coming in, right? I mean, I don't think I'm going too fast. Yeah, I just like to play it safe and get into orbit before. Um, But I think... What if I just... I, so I've still got this guy on. What if I just burn the rest of this retro? Right now, so that I'm at least coming in slower. Because my concern yeah. is that I'm, I'm going to, I'm going too fast going in. So maybe if I come up... Where do you think I burn that? Maybe, Here? yeah, right around there. How close do you guys live? Ian's about three hours from me. Yeah. So we're starting up a thing where I go visit him at least once a month so we can record some live subpixels, um, all sorts of stuff. See, that looks pretty good. We're very, I'm very excited about it. Um, yeah, because my concern is I'm picking up a lot of speed coming in straight at it, you know. Right. But that was my chief concern as well. Well, good for you. Okay, all right, so now I'm going to... Come slow. Get to my... Oh, sorry, what? <laughs> Come slow. I'm sorry. Uh, I live in Jersey City, Alexander. Okay, so I got that. Now I'm going to... Just burn... This guy off, and then I'm going to... Go off, queen. Should I just just wait here? You know what I mean? Should I burn this later or burn it now? What what altitude do you think I should burn it at? Um, I don't Save. know. Uh, Alexander, I know you meant him. He lives in Baltimore, outside of Baltimore. Screw it, I'm burning it now. Which I need to get Kyle's address. Yes. So I know where to Oh god. Okay. All right. So I'm now controlling it from here. I don't have any brakes, do I? No. I just have my parachutes. So now this guy, I just burn. I can burn this guy as retrograde. Go ahead and turn my mono propellant on. I'm gonna save this. Okay, what altitude do you think I burn this at? I'm not quite coming in as flat as I'd like. How do you think I correct that? Okay. Um, like that? I don't yeah. think it's worth. I don't think it's worth burning though. Do you think it's worth? The burning? only problem is you're gonna. You just need to slow down. I think is your biggest thing. Yeah. Well, yeah, but the good news is I have all of my mono propellant because I did not. I didn't I didn't have to burn it to drop from orbit. Right. So I'm just thinking of when do I fire that? Right before reentry? Yeah. Actually I could fire it as I'm landing, right? Let me do yeah, you just want don't wanna get in too close and then smash. Well yeah, I mean I have all my parachutes. <laughs> oh, I wish it was I wish I added some lights, but oh well. My little goobers. 
You know what? I never extended my communications antenna. Okay. Uh, I'm I'm just gonna keep quick saving here. Did Kerbal, we don't need them. Kerbal didn't always have quick saves, right? I don't remember. I want to say no, but I yeah. think I might be inaccurate. In I saying think that. it's no. Okay. How much of an atmosphere does Duna have? It has it has enough that I'm going to use parachutes, and I've tested that this this guy does work. So gotcha. see, my surface speed is going down because of the atmosphere. Yeah, you want to get that down to like five. But yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm just trying to slow down before my parachutes pop. Oh, my my two parachutes are good now. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Your 18 parachutes? What's the threshold for the parachutes? It's, um... Because they won't open if it's not, like, one no, they're atmosphere. Good. They're good. Okay, See? Just making sure. Oh, thank God. And then I can, I can bump my engine up as I need to. Which I don't think I need to yet. Yeah, you might be good. Putting my landing gear down, I'm gonna go ahead and retract that yeah you're slowing down pretty well yeah and then these will pop as well fantastic ian i just may need my engine to get down below five yeah look at that perfect yeah you're goody okay where's my shadow oh no we're... uh six more weeks of winter <laughs> Alex, you're 100% right. Baltimore is a terrible city. Actually, it's not. The city itself is awful, but there's a lot of good stuff around it. Like, it's, there's like a dozen great Korean barbecue joints all around Baltimore. You're close to DC. It's just the city itself is terrible. Yeah, I live near York, near New York City, and there's nothing good there. So, shut up. <laughs> okay, here we go. Okay, here we go. <laughs> here we go. <laughs> hey, Ian, uh, are we going? Mm, let me check real quick. Yep, we're going. Are we live? Are we? This is just us. I don't. Oh, I geez. don't think we're live. I can't. I can't. I hate how you can't. Like, I don't want this to. be... I can't tell because Discord has decided that everything that's red is one pixel. <laughs> really. So I really can't tell anything. I'm about to do the softest landing possible. <gasps> oh my goodness. We did it, baby boy. We did it. Get okay. out. Get out. Who Who's going first? You or me? You, of course. The engineer. Thanks. Well. Oh. <laughs> Base planted. Back okay. planted. Plan planting the flag here. Here we go. I'm so excited. There it is. We boys. did it. Site name. Uh, or bust. Or no, yes. let me put that in the plaque text. What is this? Um, this is um subpixel ink factory uh zero. requisitioned site uh a43-12 so pixel ink requisition site what was it i think it's a43- dash, no dash 13 dash 13 there we go let me put this here There it is, boys. Perfect. Wait, I gotta get you out. Um, I'd like to let you know that uh, our lawyer has now emailed us telling uh, me that mm -hmm. uh, our site is ready to go. Um, the All the forms went through. The, uh, the space government has said we can start producing. Uh, now that we are no longer on our Earth, the uh, 
horrible, horrible working conditions that we subject our employees to are legal no longer on Duna yeah, because we own Duna. Now. Yeah. So we can, uh, you know, we can start putting them to work and making those cars, those uh, gamer cars. There it is. Oh, that's pretty great. We did it. Oops. Aerodynamic forces overlay disabled. Ian? Yeah. This is a great moment. Ladies and gentlemen, I think that's it. Um, oh, uh, Selfish is, uh, mom is talking about any movement of the camera causes the stream quality to drop for the game. Hmm. Yeah. I wonder if that's YouTube. So I have it set at the normal right now. So it's not like ultra low latency, but it's also not best quality. But it's it should still be like 1440p. I don't know. Maybe we'll check the rewind, um, see what's going on, and see if we can figure it out. I don't think my internet is the problem. I don't even think OBS is the problem. Maybe it's YouTube. It could be OBS if it's trying to buffer no, too it much. Could be know. aliens. Anyways, Will, I think that's another fantastically successful stream. The two of us on Duna, we will be playing Thursday. We're going to Thursday. be doing Apex Legends. Apex Legends to make up for no... Uh... No, no scan lines. Uh, scan lines. And um, next Tuesday is going to be Factorio. I think the plan is we're going to set up a multiplayer server. And next Tuesday is going to be like the founding stream where it's the first time either of us jumps in the server and sets things up. And then we will be playing offline. Um, so every week after that point, it'll be kind of a check in. We need to figure out what what's our goal. Is it 100 cars per second or is it 100 cars per minute? I forget. Whatever the the 100 cars per the like thing we can attain. Yeah. I forget well, I was what, thinking, the, um, what the ratio is. I was thinking we could do the Model T. I think the Model T at the best was a car every minute 30. Okay. So a car every minute then. Yeah. I'll look it up. I think I'll look it up because Factorio has fantastic graphs so you can actually like see those numbers so i think i think we look it up and if it's like 94 seconds for the model t then we aim for that because we're better perfect i'm into it yeah okay well thanks for joining us will where can we find you you can find me crying uh you know at my house or you can find me on twitter at hunt 270 and you can find me not playing Kerbal anymore. I think I'm played out now after the last month of binging it and having finally landed on Duna. You can find me on Twitter at Think Gibson, and you can find all of our subpixel content on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter under at Well, at what was that? <laughs> at subpixel team if you follow us on any of those platforms you can be notified immediately about streams we're having videos we're putting out we also put out little clips from videos if you haven't watched the full thing it gives you a little teaser this just in from uh mom uh -huh. how uh -huh. are we going to transport all these cars back to earth um no idea we'll figure that after we make them Oh dear lord i don't like the, that subpixel aerospace premise where we have to go pick up a car from another planet and bring it back yep that's too difficult anyways anyways uh, we'll figure it out we've got we've got a fantastic car it's proven we put it in space now we just got to make um millions of them people are guaranteed to buy them um guaranteed until next time folks like we said uh instead of scan lines this week we've got apex legends on thursday and tuesday we've got factorio thanks for watching us and hey you have a good night Bye bye bye